in some of the statistics. However, they also were not teetotalers and abolitionists who were opposed to any form of slavery at all. Jews participated in proportionate numbers in both slave trading and in slave owning, especially in some of the Caribbean islands. In fact, if you go to Suriname, they have a beautiful synagogue there that's been preserved with a sand floor and beautiful declarations. You'll also notice a lot of the street names are named after Jewish families that were prominent uh, plantation owners there, but they own slaves. And if you know anything about the slavery experience in the sugar plantations in Suriname and in Curaçao, it was the most brutal, awful slavery you could imagine. Uh, amputating limbs, uh, working the slaves to death, not even bothering to feed them uh, or care for them in any way because they were cheap to just import more. I mean, it really was uh, some of the worst uh, experiences of slavery to be found. And Jews were a part of that society and a part of that experience, both in the Caribbean and also in the American South. 